Hello, and welcome to Weekly Devotions for Kids. I am so happy you are here. Today we are going to look at Psalm 119.11. It says, I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. This is such a great verse. It shows the importance of knowing God's word. Let's take a look at why. This verse begins with, I have hidden your word in my heart. Why do you think the Bible would tell us to hide God's word? Does this mean we keep it from others? Not at all. We can think of hiding God's word in our hearts like we are keeping our favorite toys safe. We want to keep it in a safe place, so maybe we put it in a locked box that only we have the key to. But we can get that toy out whenever we want to play with it. So how do we hide God's word in our heart? It's actually simple to do. We read God's word and we memorize verses, just like we're doing today. When we know God's word, we know what God wants us to do. And why would we want to know what God tells us to do and not to do in the Bible? That's right. So we do not sin or make a choice that God does not want us to make. So what is the importance of this verse? Well, by reading God's word, memorizing it and understanding what is sin in God's eyes, we can avoid sinning against God. Let's practice hiding this verse in our hearts right now. Please repeat after me. I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Psalm 119.11 Great, let's do it one more time. I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Psalm 119.11 Now I will say it all the way through one more time. I have hidden your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Psalm 119.11. Please continue practicing Psalm 119.11 and keep hiding Bible verses in your heart like the scripture says. This week, I suggest you pray that you can remember God's word so that you may know what is right and true. I would love to pray this over you right now. Is that all right with you? Okay, great. Let's pray. Dear Lord, I thank you for the Bible and how you have given it to help us follow you and become more like Jesus. Would you please help my friends as they work to keep your word hidden in their hearts, that they wouldn't sin against you? We love you with all of our hearts. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Thank you for joining me today. I hope to see you again next week.